Hi, my name is Dr. Katie Mykos, and I'll be talking to you today a little bit about what anxiety is and some things that you can do to help relieve your anxiety. Overall, anxiety is a natural, inevitable feeling that we all face daily. It could happen when we face different demands of life, different life transitions, or just daily tasks of living. Usually, with regular typical anxiety, it will decrease or disappear after the stressful event is over. And sometimes it can even be helpful to motivate people to get things done. At other times, though, anxiety can turn into an anxiety disorder. This is different. In this case, the anxiety is much more intense and the length of time is much greater. It also then can interfere with functioning, such as work functioning, family, relationships, and then just getting everyday tasks done. Now, anxiety can manifest in different ways. Those ways would be physiologically, psychologically, and behaviorally. So to get into the physiological level and to help with those symptoms, such as muscle tension and different things that happen to the body, stomach aches, headaches, sweating even, there are some relaxation techniques that are very successful. Some of those could be deep breathing exercises where you learn to breathe from the abdomen area. The second one is progressive muscle relaxation where you learn to tense and relax different muscle groups where you learn the difference between those feelings. And third would be an imagery technique where you learn to imagine peaceful and secure calming scenes that give you an overall sense of relief and relaxation. Another type of technique that's very helpful are self-talk techniques. Self-talk are thoughts that we have that we say to ourselves in response to a situation. Sometimes these thoughts can be very negative. And so what happens is, depending on what we say to ourselves, that's going to influence how we feel and then in turn how we behave. So let me give an example. Let's say you go to a restaurant and the waiter says to you, your favorite food is no longer available on the menu. One person can have some self-talk thoughts such as, what am I gonna do now? I need to go to another restaurant. And they end up feeling very angry and very frustrated. The other person, on the other hand, says to themselves, oh, well, you know, I'll probably like something on the menu. It's fine. They feel very calm and even excited about trying a new food. Same situation for both, both people, but because they interpret and perceive the situation in different ways, they then therefore have different feelings. So what you want to do is counter the self-talk and where you come up with more positive statements to your self-talk, or you can use Socratic method, where with that, you ask yourself things such as, is this really true? What's the evidence for this thought? And you try to come up with a more rational, balanced thought. So both relaxation techniques and counteracting your self-talk are both ways that you can help your anxiety.